name is Nick Crawford, uh, I'm the church governor, raised me at the school. I'm here to make a short statement on behalf of the school. Uh, 9.30 this morning, one of our year three classrooms, um, so in one of our year three classrooms, a ceiling collapsed, resulting in the attendance of the emergency services. 16 children and one teacher were in the room when the ceiling collapsed. Unfortunately, some injuries were sustained and 11 children were taken to hospital along with two adults. There were no life-threatening or life-changing injuries and the majority have been discharged. We are working closely with the authorities and relevant specialists to understand the cause of the incident. Therefore, it is inappropriate uh, that we speculate or comment further at this stage. This has been a worrying time for the children involved, their families and the wider school. We understand from initial examinations that there were no concerns regarding the rest of the building. We will work with the authorities in regards, um, regarding any investigations to be undertaken. We would like to sincerely thank members of staff, the emergency services and those who sent messages of support from the wider community. As I'm sure you'll understand, I can't, ask, I can't answer any more questions at this stage. We will provide further updates on our website. Ida Bennett from Sky News. How many children remain in hospital and what is their condition? So, as I said, I can't really give any updates on that, as you'll appreciate. Um, I told you how many went. Um, any further updates? You said some website. remain in hospital, and I think everyone will be concerned about what their condition is. Can you give any indication about how serious their injuries are? As you'll appreciate, are? I'm standing here, still not in the hospital, so I'm sorry. Um, I clearly wouldn't be able to give you an update on that at this stage. From the teaching staff, that's correct. That's right. I'm going to have to get back in now. Thank you very much. Appreciate your concern, and uh, sorry about that. Thank you. Cheers.